Hello and welcome to the session. In this session, we will discuss a question which says that a giant Ferris wheel has a height of 64.75 meters and a diameter of 60.96 meters. It makes a revolution every 4.25 minutes. The equation A is equal to 30.48 sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into T the whole plus 34.27 shows the relationship between the altitude reached by the Ferris wheel and time in minutes. In what time the wheel will reach the altitude of 60 meters? Now before starting the solution of this question, we should know a result. And that is definition of sine inverse, which is y is equal to sine theta if and only if sine inverse of y is equal to theta when theta belongs to the closed interval minus pi by 2 to pi by 2. Now this result will work out as a key idea for solving out the given question. Now let us start with the solution of the given question. Now here we are given equation of the model as A is equal to 30.48 sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into T the whole plus 34.27 where A gives the altitude reached by the Ferris wheel and T is the time in minutes. Now we have to find in what time the wheel will reach the altitude of 60 meters. It means we have to find T when a is equal to 60 meters. Now let this equation be equation number 1. So putting A is equal to 60 in equation number 1 we get 60 is equal to 30.48 into sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into T the whole plus 34.27. Now we will solve this equation for T. Now this implies 60 minus 34.27 is equal to 30.48 into sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into T the whole. And this further implies 25.73 is equal to 30.48 into sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into t the whole. Now dividing both sides by 30.48, this implies 25.73 upon 30.48 is equal to sine of 2 pi upon 4.25 into t the whole. Now from the key idea we know the definition of sine inverse. So by definition of sine inverse we have sine inverse of 25.73 upon 30.48 the whole is equal to 2 pi upon 4.25 into t. And now multiplying both sides by 4.25 upon 2 pi we get 4.25 upon 2 pi into sine inverse of 25.73 upon 30.48 the whole is equal to t. Now using calculator 25.73 upon 30.48 is approximately equal to 0.844. So this implies T is approximately equal to 
4.25 upon 2 pi into sine inverse of 0 0.844 and this implies T is approximately equal to 4.25 upon 2 pi and using scientific calculator sine inverse of 0 0.844 is approximately equal to 57.56 degrees. Now converting this into radians, this will be 4.25 upon 2 pi into 57.56 degrees into pi upon 180 degrees. Now again using calculator, this is approximately equal to 0 0.6795. So, for A is equal to 60 meters, we are getting T is equal to 0 0.6795 minutes approximately. So here, T is approximately equal to 0 0.68 minutes. Thus, V reaches altitude of 60 meters in 0 0.68 minutes approximately. And this is the solution of the given question. That's all for this session. Hope you all have enjoyed the session.